We have discussed a number of times the risk of an earnings recession. Uh, so far in 2023, we have already seen a significant downgrade of earnings estimates of those sectors that benefited from the reopening. Airlines, oil companies, all of those that benefited both from the commodity and the increase of activity after the reopening from the pandemic. However, we are also seeing a weakening of estimates in the defensive sectors. Higher taxes, weaker margins, weaker sales mean downgrades of earnings per share. In the United States, we have a factor which is massive buybacks helping earnings per share. But in Europe, that doesn't happen. Think about this. As this graph by Morgan Stanley shows, the earnings recession risk, moving earnings into negative territory, is quite significant, both on the cyclical sectors, but also on the defensive sectors. In a nutshell, what we're finding is that the very poor recovery of the economy added to increases in taxes and inflationary pressures are going to put an even bigger threat and a bigger burden on companies' earnings, and it's showing in those that are providing an outlook for 2023 and 2024. They're actually being either very vague or not particularly bullish.